so lying or sitting comfortably, just connecting to the support of whatever you're sitting or lying on. And just begin by considering these questions. Can you imagine letting your mind and body naturally and effortlessly respond to the following questions about your ability to imagine certain experiences. Can you imagine not giving any particular effort to listening to the questions or achieving any of the associated images or experiences? Can you imagine that the ideal response is whatever spontaneously happens to your imagery or experience when a particular question is asked? And can you imagine that the ideal response is whatever spontaneously happens? I think I said that one already. Can you imagine that your opening and expanding awareness of your experience is a continuing process? And now see if it's possible to imagine the distance between your eyes. Is it possible for you to imagine the space inside your nose as you inhale and exhale naturally? Can you imagine the space behind your eyes as you inhale naturally and your breath flowing in and out easily. Can you imagine the distance between the space inside your nose and your eyes? Is it possible for you to imagine the space inside your throat as you inhale naturally? Can you imagine the distance between the space inside your throat and the space inside your nose? See if you can imagine the space inside your mouth and cheeks. Can you imagine the surface of your tongue? Is it possible to imagine the entire volume of your tongue? Can you imagine the volume of your teeth and gums? See if you can imagine the volume of your lips.
is it possible to imagine the distance between your upper lip and your nose? Can you imagine the distance between the space inside your throat and the tip of your chin? Can you imagine the space inside your ears? Is it possible to imagine the distance between the space inside your throat and the space inside your ears? Can you imagine the distance between the tip of your chin and the space inside your ears? How about trying to imagine the distance between your ears? Or can you imagine the distance between the tip of your chin and your temples? Can you imagine the distance between your temples? Can you imagine the distance between the tip of your chin and the back of your neck? Or can you imagine the distance between the tip of your chin and the top of your head? Is it possible to imagine the distance between the tip of your chin and your cheekbones? Let's see if you can imagine the distance between your cheekbones. Can you imagine the distance between the tip of your chin and your eyes? And then see if you can imagine the distance between your eyes. Can you imagine the distance between the tip of your chin and the middle of your forehead? Can you imagine the distance between the tip of your chin and the corners of your mouth?
And can you imagine the distance between the tip of your chin and your lower lip? Is it possible to imagine the distance between the corners of your mouth and your nostrils? And then see if you're able to imagine the volume of your entire jaw. Can you imagine the space inside the bridge of your nose? Can you imagine the distance between the space inside the bridge of your nose and the back of your head? Can you imagine the distance between the space inside the bridge of your nose and your eyes? Is it possible to imagine that the region around your eyes is filled with space? Can you imagine the distance between your eyelids and your eyebrows? Can you imagine the volume of your forehead? Is it possible to imagine the distance between the space inside the bridge of your nose and the middle of your forehead? Can you imagine the distance between the space inside of your nose and your hairline? Can you imagine the volume of your entire face simultaneously, including your ears, your jaw, your nose, your tongue and teeth and gums, and your lips? And can you include in that imagination the volume of your scalp? Can you imagine that as you inhale naturally, your breath fills the entire volume of your face, scalp and head, including your ears and jaws and eyes. And that as you exhale and your breath leaves your body, it leaves your face, scalp and head empty and filled with space. Breathing in, imagining that volume filling with breath. Breathing out and allowing for space. Can you imagine the distance? I'm sorry, can you imagine the space inside your throat until your entire neck 
is filled with space. Is it possible to imagine the distance between the space inside your neck and the tips of your shoulders? Can you imagine the volume of your upper arms? And is it possible to imagine the volume of your shoulders and upper arms and lower arms simultaneously? Can you imagine the volume of your whole of your arms and your hands? And see if you can imagine that as you inhale naturally, your breath fills your entire head, neck, shoulders, arms, and hands. And that as you exhale, your breath leaves your body and it leaves this region filled with space. See if you can imagine that at the same time you're aware of the space inside this entire region, is it possible for you to also imagine the space around these regions, the space between your fingers, the space between your arms and your body, the space around your arms, around your shoulders, neck, and head, Imagine all the space inside you and outside you as if it becomes continuous. Your boundaries soften and open. Can you imagine that as you continue to practice, your experience will become more vivid and more effortless? Can you imagine practicing this every day? As you begin to bring your awareness back to yourself, back into this room, just begin to wiggle your fingers and your feet, roll your head a little side to side, and find our way up to standing just to see how, how this experience is felt in you.